Hello everyone. Today we'll see about trivial and non-trivial function dependency. See, they are given some dependencies, and we have to determine means which dependency is means trivial and which dependency is non-trivial. So I've told you in earlier video means um how can we distinguish between trivial and non-trivial uh, function dependency. So before watching this video, please uh, I'll tell you to watch this previous video so that you'll understand better. So let's see. So this is given here is given this function dependency x function dependency y z. See they have given these dependencies. Now we have to check these dependencies trivial or non-trivial. So I told you what is non-trivial. Non-trivial means if x is a function dependency on y, then x intersection y should be phi means it should be null set. It should be a null set. So see here is this dependency is a trivial non-trivial. How can you check see? Here the set is given a to a one three in x set of attribute. This is the elements are there a to a one three. Now to check in both the a see this values and this values see please see see a in this this here a these are containing one three in in similarly a also here containing one three and here also a are containing one three only. If the it 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 means it's a trivial function dependency means it is always true, always true means x is a superset of y, x is a superset of y z. So what what will be see if it happens like this that here a contains two three below and here a contains one three below, then it will be false means it will be a non-trivial function dependency. But here we are seeing that. Here a x in say in x set of attributes a is containing one three value. Similarly here also a containing one three value. So it's a trivial function dependency means it is it's a trivial function dependency means it's, this relation is a yes it it is a trivial function dependency. In see the see the next one is this is given function dependency a b function dependency c. Now. You have to check this is a trivial or non-trivial C. There in this set 5, 4, 3, 5, 4, 3, 6, 5, 3, 6, 6, 3. See these two. 5, 4, 3 is containing same value 3 and 3. So it means it's a function dependency. This is a trivial function dependency. So see how easy it is to check which one is trivial or non-trivial. See this one. C function dependency D. See now it will say see. In this set 5, 6, 5 given the value. 5, 6, 5. Now see, this is interesting. 5 and 6, 6. 5 and 6, 7. See, see same value, 5. All, all the four values are same. But they are counting different values. 6, 5, 6, 6, 6, 7. It means it is not a trivial function dependency. It is a non-trivial function dependency. It means it is not a function dependency. It does not follow the rules of function dependencies. The last one see B C function dependency A and see there are three two containing value A see three two again containing value A and three two containing value A only means it is also a trivial function dependency because see this set and the this three set having equal value they also contain equal value so it is a trivial function dependency so this is also a function dependency see how easy it is so in next video we will see the closer attributes closer set of attributes how to find the closer set of attributes and please subscribe my channel so that you can get the notification of my upcoming videos thanks for watching thank you